have to remember to share my screen. You're not fucking excited for this? Sure. I need to share my screen. Go live. There we go. All right. <clears throat> Everybody, welcome back. Uh, slow starting because I forgot to share my screen. Um, if you would, remember to like, comment, and subscribe as per usual. Nothing new there. Uh, I'm joined today by Fortunato from Edgar Allan Poe's Cask of the Amontillado. Um, exactly. You die at the end of that story, by the way. Um, yep, I figured. Yeah, he leads you down. He leads you down a long hallway, uh, and he's like, "Hey, I got like I think it's like he's like, hey, I got like this ten thousand dollar bottle of wine. You want to see it?" And then he kicks him into like this uh, like room, and then just lays bricks. And it's like later, dude, and he's just like he dies. Back anyway, the Ripper type shit, dude. Um, well, no. Yes. I would assume there would be like head cutting off. Yeah, probably. Pretty sure, pretty sure he did that. Um, Man. That was, uh, you learned a little bit. See, we're culturing you here on the channel. Also, uh, we're still trying to get that first video of this series up to 1,000 views, and it's up to 750. But we kind of slowed down our rate. Let's bump those fucking numbers up, just like uh, fucking Leonardo DiCaprio in uh, Wolf of Wall Street. You got to bump those fucking numbers up, you know what I'm saying? Um, well, let's get back to this. That would probably be good. Um, yeah. I'm going to do alien just because I want to, even though it's wrong. Starts an A, though, and E's right there. So. Look at that. Hmm. Gonna put angel, but there's no N. No R. Um. Hmm. Put this here, I guess. Lame. Boy, that would have been something. Yeah, would it have? It would have been fucked up if because uh, if you literally didn't get D, you were just fucked. Yeah, yeah. Hmm. Uh... Hmm. <clears throat> well, shit. Yeah, this is not great. Um, a. What about a skew? Okay. <laughs> well, we'll do it. All right. Take it. I was trying to zoom in on this one. <clears throat> Full disclosure here obviously, I have to get up all of the um, tabs before I start. I tried to zoom in on this picture, but it just wasn't having it. Um, this particular. Shot is not giving me any sort of anything here, so. No. I never saw this movie, but I knew it was in that region, I believe. <clears throat> um, why don't they ever have the fucking ones that I'm just trying to meme with? Blood from the Mummy's Tomb. Um, uh, I don't know. 
Is she getting abducted? No, this is okay. So I was gonna say it looks like the lighting, like she's uh, on a stage, and you can see people to the right hand side here. So she's acting. Well, that is true. Um, I don't know. Like I at first thought it was just bad lighting in the movie, but no, she's acting. Uh, do we think this is um, uh, Phantom of the Opera? I don't know why there would be... Okay, no. Uh, I don't know why there would be, like, Indian iconography here. I don't know. Is that Buddha? I don't I don't know. I don't want to make myself sound stupid. It could be one of the gods, and I don't know which one. Shiva? Um, so what does Indian iconography... Uh, theater of some sort and some bald guy's head have to do with anything i don't i don't really know yeah is this uh jk simmons face ass Who i i actually was thinking the exact same thing is this an all-state commercial yeah, 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 yeah. alulia i don't know what this is uh so we're gonna need another we're gonna put it follows Oh, okay. So this is, um, Birdman. Okay. When does this? When does this? In Birdman. When is this? I, when I saw the stage, I thought Birdman, but I have no idea. I guess that's Michael Keaton. Okay. You ever see this movie, Colin? Nope. Incredibly overrated. Yeah, you told me uh, not to watch it, so. I didn't, I was, I will not say not to watch it. I just think it's overrated. In my opinion. I should say that. In my opinion, it's overrated. Um, I think the cinematography is good. Um, can't remember, is this Nefaratu? No, no, it's one of the really big um, Hispanic directors. So it's like Nolan Arenado. Because you got like Alfonso Cuaron, who did Gravity, which that movie seemed really impressive at the time. But isn't that impressive anymore? Because even that shitty movie that we saw with Patrick Wilson, Moonfall or whatever, had decent uh -huh. cinematography. So um, this is weird. I don't. I had to guess watch this again because I do not remember whatever the hell this is. At all. is this just his room? I guess that was in intentionally trying to throw you. This is like a dead giveaway though. So whatever. All right, can we get a song that I like or know within the first ten seconds so I don't have to edit it? <laughs> Uh, can't get no satisfaction. That is probably the easiest one I've ever got. I gotta get out of here before it fucks me. Okay. Uh, I believe this is uh, on the Balkan Peninsula. It's not. Not even close. Oh my god. <laughs> I thought this you was the, right in the You're on the other side of the world, my man. So this is weird because we actually got it in specifically the worst place to ask because it could be left or right because it's literally right in the middle, right? Mm -hmm. So I don't think anything in South America has this shape. Unless it's near the bottom. <clears throat> I don't think so. I mean, I, I, what's our what's our play here? Let's uh, let's put something in South America. See if it's northwest. Okay, so this is this is Central America. Ugh. Guatemala face ass. Uh, oh, yep. Uh, what the hell else is down there? There we go. It's Costa Rica. Hmm. Sweet. Who do we start our wardle off with? Nolan Arenado. Okay. Wow. Great job getting absolutely fucking nothing, dude. Uh, American You're welcome. League left handed, not from America. Um, oh, not American League. I was going to say Carlos Rodon because he's left handed, but not National League. Uh. Let's do Patrick Sandoval. He's left-handed. I didn't. Patrick Sandoval is for the United States. Okay, good enough. Not a starting pitcher. In the American League, he's left-handed. How about Jose Ramirez, Colin's favorite? 
He's not a third baseman, though. Oh, oops, that's my bad. But we cut down, and we know that it's NL East. Or AL East, I'm sorry. We uh, think he's younger or older? I think he's younger. Like, really young, I guess. Hmm. In the East. So, it's like... Is he right-handed? Yeah, Bo- I was thinking Bo Bichette. I was thinking the same He's thing. He's right-handed. Um, so not Toronto, so it would have to be... I'm, I'm starting to think more and more now that he's super old for some reason. Do we have a left-handed bat that's older? In the east. So we're talking Boston. Um, it could be a pitcher, not just not a starting pitcher, right? So, Ugh, like uh, a Raldis Chapman. Yeah, let's let's do Chapman. Let's see if that works. Chapman. Let's make sure to pick Araldis here. There we go. Yeah. Yeah. 34. Okay. Uh, we've gotten them all so far, right? Mm, yes. This is usually where the roadblock happens, though. A.J. Brown. So, in the AFC, not a wide receiver, but taller than... What's, uh, what's his name? Zach Wilson. Yeah, I'm going to go with that. Okay, AFC East quarterback. He's mm. age 23, taller than 6'2". Uh, I mean, it's gonna, it's gonna be a Josh, starting quarterback. Josh Allen? Or no, he's too young. Tua? Could it be Tua? It's gonna be Tua. You're right. It's not Tua. Oh. It, oh, it's uh, Mac. Jones. Oh yeah, Macky. Mac boy. Play hard mode. So we got to start with Mac Jones, which will probably not be helpful at all. Let's see. He's below six foot three, and he's in the NFC. Okay. His number's higher than ten, though. Uh. NFC wide receivers here. Uh, You're thinking it is a wide receiver? I don't know. Why not? I'm going to go with Trey Quinn Smith. Uh, he's six foot two, and he's not a wide receiver, so probably defense. You also, they had the same number. How about that? How about that? I think we need to switch to defense. I'm thinking this yeah. is like a... I, think it's like a, a, I mean, quarter safety. linebacker, safety is all on the safety table. Safety or corner. Safeties have been giving us the most hell, so that's great. And he's a little bit older, it would seem. Let's try. A PP. Okay, he's, you know on, me. he's on defense. He's six foot two. He's in the NFC West. Uh, let's do. Uh, always forget. Oops. Is the Johnson, who's a safety, is he with. I think he's with the Rams, right? I get Jefferson and Johnson screwed up. No, Ugh. he's not. Um, okay, so it's not. A, it's got to be a linebacker then, I think. Okay. Um, and he is older than 31. <sighs> when did Von Miller get signed by Buffalo? Hello? <laughs> he's older than 33? Rel Suggs, are you still playing? No. His number's oh, higher than forty three. And it's not a linebacker. Okay. So could he Is that six two though? You what the hell else could it be? It could be a defensive lineman, I guess. That's a pretty short defensive lineman. Um so it's probably 34, 35. So who's kind of like the aging? What about, uh, does this guy still play? No, okay. He's still a linebacker, though. I was going to put Ryan Kerrigan. So this is a guy we should know at least, right? Um, yeah. You know what? Let's let's narrow this down to see if we need it's... to get back to like the NFC West and shit, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so it's the NFC East. He's definitely 34, six foot two. Um, probably, I mean, his number is really, well, relatively high. Um, so you would think it's probably defensive lineman, I guess. Um, so who do we, do we have any noteworthy defensive lineman in the NFC East? 
What about like Fletcher Cox? Is he still fucking over there? Uh, yes. He's with Philly. He's not a defensive lineman, though. Fletcher Cox is only 31? <laughs> yeah. So does that what? mean he could be like a, a kicker? Maybe a six foot two kicker or punter or something? I mean, kickers are old. Who the fuck is the kicker for Philly? Uh, I initially wanted to say Nick Folt, but that, don't they have a young kid? So it can't be a kicker. I think they have a young, younger kicker. 34 years old. Do you think they're going to make like a distinguish between like a linebacker and like an edge or something? Is Jason Kelsey on offense? Yeah, he's a center, yeah, right? Yeah, he's a center, yeah. Because he's old as fuck, too. Ugh. Okay, uh... Damn. Well, uh, let's just think, like, who else there is old as hell? Uh... But we did linebacker, defensive tackle. Does it, I mean, are they gonna, like, distinguish between defensive tackle and defensive end as opposed to linebacker? Probably, but I don't know. Remember Dahani Jones? He always wore that bow tie. He used to play with the Eagles. Um, who's the other guy that they have in the D line? It's not Fletcher Cox. They have another guy who's good, but is like old. Brandon Graham? Ah, there you go. There you go. Nice. We did it. That's exactly the guy I was thinking of. So nice work. Okay. This we're going for perfect right here. Okay. Pretty Oh, it's like DeMar DeRozan face. <laughs> it, it does or Paul George. Honestly. We'll put DeMar DeRozan. And then we'll put Paul wait. Paul George. Yep. Told you it was fucking Paul George. Look at that hand. Oh my god. I literally only get it. these. I only get these literally from the silhouettes. <laughs> I, I got this one. I'll say it's first try, right? Because it was the one I said it was. And then uh, I got Kelly Olynyk on my other perfect on the first try because I could tell by his head because he looked like a white trash white guy. No offense, Kelly. Okay? We all appreciate the fact that you can shoot threes and you're a center. Even though you're pretty much terrible otherwise. Shout out to Gonzaga. I think he went to, You know what? Let's check that out real quick. I think he went to Gonzaga. If he didn't go to Gonzaga, then I look like an asshole. Which it wouldn't be the first time. Canada. Just keeps on saying Canada. Okay. Oh, oh, oh. Gonzaga. Easy. Easy peasy. So that's the first perfect we got as a tandem. Um, now uh, that I've taken Fortunato down the hallway, I can kick him into the hole and then put the bricks up so he can't leave. Um, Sounds good. But uh, it wasn't. It, this wasn't exactly what's the word I'm looking for our best like we did perfect but we did it wasn't like we didn't get things like on our first try other than hurdle because i know the rolling stones it's weird how yesterday i can get lauren hill and have no idea what it is and today i can get the rolling stones which i believe everyone's heard that song at least once in a lifetime maybe not i don't know anyway that's gonna wrap the video um once again like comment and subscribe more ideas in the bottom of the the thing with the people and the talking and such um those are called later. comments. Thanks for. I did say comment already. I just I wanted to say below and something, but it didn't work out, so it's fine. Why are you even here? Shut up. All right. Uh, yeah, see, you, see you tomorrow. Bye.